Welcome to the Verification and Validation Guide. This guide is meant to demonstrate how to use NSLate for verification and validation. If you haven't already, we recommend watching the Requirements Management and Analysis video guide before proceeding. A link is in the description. According to the IEEE Standard for System and Software, verification and validation are used to determine whether the development products of a given activity conform to the requirements of that activity and whether the product satisfies its intended use and user needs. The goal of VNV is to ensure the resultant product, service, or system being developed meets or exceeds customer expectations. Without implementing proper VNV procedures while engineering a system, it is highly likely the product, service, or system wouldn't even actually be able to be built, let alone function properly. Inneslate facilitates these system lifecycle procedures with integrated tools and a new purposeful built user interface called Test Center. Our purpose for integrating these tools is to decrease the amount of time it takes to complete the verification and validation process, and therefore encourage those processes to occur more frequently throughout the system's engineering lifecycle. Before trying to verify the product, service, or system meets the design requirements and system models, it is important to first validate whether or not those requirements and models are correct. It is important to begin the validation process early in the life cycle to enhance the probability of success by identifying errors early on in the development phase and preparing for the verification process later in the life cycle. Requirements validation is an iterative process which should be done throughout the system engineering life cycle. Regular questioning and analyzing the quality of each requirement ensures at the end of your requirements, gathering, and capture efforts, you will be left with well-written and verifiable requirements. Inneslate provides integrated tools to help automate requirements validation, such as the quality check feature of requirements view. The quality check feature is used to assess the requirements clarity, completeness, consistency, design implications, traceability, and verifiability. If you haven't already read the Analyze Requirements section of our Requirements Management and Analysis Guide for more information on the Quality Check feature of Requirements View and instructions on how to be read it, a link is provided in the description. During this process, it is important to double check that each requirement is traceable back to the origin of the requirement and every change has been tracked through the life of the requirement. Inneslate takes care of most of this by automatically creating relationships between entities and the original upload artifact and tracking changes to maintain a version history on every entity. Model validation is another iterative process, which should also be done throughout the system's engineering lifecycle. Regularly questioning and analyzing the quality of each model ensures at the end of your behavioral and physical modeling efforts, you'll be left with a model complete enough to be executable. Inneslate provides integrated tools to help complete model validation as well, such as the Intelligence tool to assess the model's traceability, constructive instruction naming conventions, and more. If you haven't already, please read Ensuring Overall Model Quality section of our Model-Based Systems Engineering Guide for more information on the Intelligence tool and instructions on how to run it. Other built-in tools include the Discrete Event Simulator and the Monte Carlo Simulator to help determine whether or not a model is executable and help reduce uncertainty of a product, service, or system's cost, schedule, and performance. If you haven't already, read the Executing the Model section of our Model-Based Systems Engineering Guide for more information on the simulators and instructions on how to run them. Now that you are assured the right requirements and correct systems models are captured in Inneslate, you can begin the process of verifying the system built between the previously validated design requirements and system models. The process in Inneslate is primarily accomplished using Test Center, a hierarchical document like the display of test case entities with collapsible sections, status roll up, and inline entity editing.